We are about to do a paranormal investigation at a 6,000 year old burial chamber. Can the spirits of Halloween play board games? Let's put that to the test. Spiritual Awakening. Scientists and their never ending fascination with light set out to devise ways of isolating smaller and smaller units of it. It proved to be the passageway through the looking glass. It was a crossing of a threshold into a wonderland with the known rules of physics don't apply. For the first time, we were able to isolate the tiniest unit of light, a single photon. <clears throat> and to perform Young's double slit experiment on a whole new level, tracing its precise path for the right slit or the left slit. We'll pull over to the side of the road for the best possible view of which slit, the right or the left, the photon passes through to get to the far wall. Left slit, right slit, another right slit, left slit. If we watch them all day long, the pattern would be random. Half would go through either side. Wait a second. Where are the waves? Where's Young's interference pattern? This is where the weird begins. I cannot explain to you what you're about to see. That's because nobody on earth understands it yet. If you can't live with that, you're not gonna be happy with what lies up ahead. On the smallest possible scale we've ever discovered, the quantum universe, the mere act of observation changes reality. Okay, photons, keep on coming. This time, we promise not to look. You're not gonna believe this but we can change the pattern on the far wall simply by not watching. I know it sounds crazy, but in every trial ever conducted, the outcome depends on whether or not the experiment was being observed. So the reason we didn't get the interference pattern earlier wasn't because we chopped up the light into single photons. We were observing which slit the photons pass through. But how can a photon know if someone's watching it? We've come to Tinkinswood burial chamber to do an experiment. It's based on Young's split experiment, see? Now, the very observation of Young's experiment means that if you observe something, then its effects change. So is that the same with when we're trying to observe things or asking spirits to move stuff for us, that if we're observing it, it's not gonna move. But if we look away, will it move? So this is the question. So we're gonna set up a Jumanji board game on the table. We're going to put the pieces on the board. We're gonna cover the board with a box and we'll walk away and we'll ask, we'll ask the spirits to move the pieces. There'll be a camera on the board so you can see that no one's gone near it and we'll lift the box up and we'll see if the pieces have moved on the board. So we're going to give the Ouija board a little, little go to see if we can stir up the spirits here. I have forgotten my ball. I've actually lost my planchette somewhere. So right now we just got this. It's a green olives jar. There's nothing special about it. This is it. You know how it goes. You know how we roll, you know, sometimes you forget things, you just gotta improvise, you know, improvise and use a jar. I mean, you can use glass, you can use a glass on the Ouija board, I've done that before. In Bronny Garth, one of the first times I ever did a Ouija board, we used glass on the board instead of a planchette. It was an event in Bronny Garth Hospital, um, I can't remember the name of the event holders themselves right now, but I'll, I'll look that up. So now we're gonna give this a go. So. Let's put our fingers on top, so let's go around with it a minute, Paolo. Calling all the spirits here, can you please come forward and communicate with us? Spirits, if you're here, can you please move this glass jar to yes on the board? Can you move it for us, please? Can you show us that you're here? Spirits, come on. Move this jar. Let's 
go around that again. One, two, three, four, five, six. If there's any spirits here that would like to communicate with us, please do so. Move this jar on the Ouija board to yes. Can you do that for us, please, spirits? Can you move this jar on the board? Can you move it to yes? Is there anyone here at all? Imam! Come forward and communicate with us, please. Come on. Show us that you're here. Imam. I've spoken to you here before on the Ouija board. What do you reckon? Nothing's coming through here, is it? Nothing's coming through. Aye. My hand's aching already. Yeah. Two fingers. Spirits, this is your time now. Come on, it looks like my hand's weird. <laughs> spirits! Come on now. Spirits of Tinkinswood. The spirits of Tinkinswood burial chamber. Come forward, communicate with us. Show us how powerful you are. Show us how strong you are. Show us what you can do. We've come here to prove to the world that the spirits are real. Come on now, move this jar. Move it to yes on the board for me, please. Okay. So it doesn't look like the Ouija board is working. So we're gonna be using the PMB music box. And this is how it works. You turn it on. It'll calibrate. And then if anything walks in front or goes in front of the sensor on this PMB music box, it sounds like this. So we'll know exactly if anything goes in front of it. That is the PMB music box. So we've got some objects on this table. We've got a Ouija board. If you go in front of this music box for us, it'll sound like this. It'll let us know that you're here. Also, there's a bell. If you could please touch the bell or move this glass. Is that something you can do for us? Or can you make a noise? I'm gonna whistle and I'd like you to whistle back, please. Spirits, communicate with us, please. Come on. <whistles> Copy me. <whistles> this, this chamber, hundreds of skeletons of men, women, and children were excavated here. This chamber was used as a burial chamber for a long, Long time, we're talking 6,000 years. That's, that's a long time ago. This place. I mean, how do they even move the capstone? It weighs tons and tons. So spirits, we command you to communicate with us. Come forward now. Communicate with us. Use your words. Speak to us. Tap, bang, make a noise. Show us that you're here. Come on. I command you, spirits! Imam! Come forward! I know that you're here. We call upon you. Help us, please. Help us with our investigation. <whistles> Copy me, please, spirits! Yeah.
It's walking. Yeah, I can hear someone walking. Get freaked out now because it sounds like there's someone walking around us. You can hear like the rustling of their footsteps. Yeah, I'm not scared of uh, nothing. I'm I'm not, I'm just scared of the physical, like the actual things that can hurt us. So. What the hell? I mean, let's, let's be quiet. Actually. Ema, are you there? See much? It's like pitch, pitch black out there. That was a bit weird. I mean, there was definitely some noises. Why not? I don't like those. No, I don't. Because there's a bunch of holes. I'm scared something's gonna pop out of me and eat me. Oh, no. I'm shaking. Oh, yeah, I don't I'm like freezing, this. That's all. Yeah, I know. I'm a bit cold. We're literally like Glastonbury when it rains. It's like that. <laughs> Being in my tent in glass to be like this. <laughs> I'm not even joking. 2008, I think that was. Okay. So, okay, we're going to do the assets method now. I don't want him. You don't want him? I, don't, I, oh, I just want to hear on the spirit box together. You're too scared? <laughs> yeah. Well, if, if you do the, if you do the assets method, you you got the blindfold on, you're ignorantly blessed. You don't know what's going on around you. What's that, a massive spider? Where? Oh my god, he's looking at us. No, he's not. Yeah. He's got you want your blood. It's Eman. I'm jumping on now. <laughs> For those of you that don't know, the Astus method is a spirit box. A spirit box is a modified radio that skips through radio channels. And it sort of sounds like... So close. And you'll hear voices come through like that, and then he'll say it. Okay then, Paolo, put the mask on. And make sure... Okay. Mama. Spirits. Can you please communicate? Uh, can you please communicate with me through Paolo on the Astus method now? Something. Can you please tell me your name? Yes, I. Can we please get your name then? Jane. 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 Thank you. Can I please get your age, please, Jane? What is your age? Jane, are you still there? Heart. Now, Jane, are you still there, please? Are you still with us, Jane? Don't think about... Can I get your age, please, Jane? <clears throat> Jane, can you please go in front of this music box? Can you please go in front of the music box or hit this bell or move this glass on the Ouija board? Can you do that for us, please, spirits? From? Jane, are you still there? Is Eman there? Imam, can you come through and communicate My with me? My grandmother always. Is this a grandmother of one of us? Are you a member of our family? Country. Country. Is the country sinister? This place is sinister. This place is very sinister and spooky. Do you know my name? You are. Can you please tell me how many people you see? Living people. How many of us do you see here? Can't touch any time. You can't touch our objects, our devices. We'd like you to. Now this place. I. 
I'm getting really spooked out because it sounds like people are walking around us on the grass. British just arrived. Is this where you were buried? Did you die here? Were you buried in this burial chamber? Is anybody there? Please communicate with us, please. Come on. <clears throat> Somewhere. Somewhere? I want to hold the money. You want to hold the money? Were you some sort of banker? If you want. Or a rich man? Or a thief? What did you used to do when you were living? So I am. You don't want... What what did you what did you do for work? Stay you... on your. Do you want to dance? Yes, I'll dance with right. you. Right. Do you want to dance? Thirty. Thirty. Is that your age? Are you thirty? Or was Seven. you thirty? Thirty-seven. Wow. Can you just confirm? I... Can you confirm that's your age, please? Exactly. Thank you. Do you know my age? What is my age? So... Can you tell me my age? For I am. For I am. What the hell? Okay, my... so... who Are we speaking to Jane still? I have. How many spirits are present in this burial chamber? I want it. Dance? Can you tell us how many spirits are in this burial chamber? I'm here. How many of you are there? Now you've got to. I am. Um, Is that you that went in? Can you please bang or knock or shout or scream? You're just to be a bit. Do you still want to dance? If you're wait, is there anybody here? Anybody at all? We'll talk, we'll talk about, that was a good night then. Do you remember me Ouch. from before? Do I have a familiar face? Ow, was whack my head again. No. No. Take your s stuff. Take my stuff. Do you not want us here? It just said cheer, take away. You want us to take away one chair? Rice. What was that? I don't know how. I'll move it for you. Now, spirits, how many of us here do you um, see? How many people do you see? How many living people are in this chamber right now? Come on. How many living people are in this chamber? How many of us do you I see? I guess. Company. You like our company, do you? Heart. Do you know who I am? I don't know. What the hell? Do you know my name? Do you know where I'm from? Or where are you from? You said that you were 37.
<coughs> Did you have a wife and children? I like children? What? <laughs> did he just say children at the same time as me? And did he just say what I think he said? That is weird. That was really weird. So, did you just say something about children? Marvellous. Are, are you a child? A little bit. What the hell? Can I get your age, please, if you're a child? Were you ten? Or younger? What the... I just hear that noise. My words. Limits? I've got the chills right now. Oh my Disco. God. I'm so fucking scared right now. I'm not gonna lie. I've got the shivers. I can hear something. Spirits, are you here? How many of us do you see? How many living people are in this in this burial chamber? Who? Is there anyone here? Yes. Then who are you? Who are you? Thomas. No way! Oh my, Thomas who? That's a response, that's a oh. response. Okay, let's ask something else. Can you tell me what day it is today? What day is it? Spin around. Eh? What day is it? Help me launch my... What are you trying to launch? The greatest. The greatest. The greatest what? We could, I reckon. <laughs> And I'm dreaming. What are you dreaming of? I left. Did you leave this place? At the one. Are you still there, uh Tom? Tom, are you still there? You still with us, Tom? Count. Again. On the count of three, can you whistle? Point at the camera. What? One, two, three. Caught off guard, eh? So what we're going to do is, we're going to set this board up on the table, this Jumanji, and we're going to see if the spirits can move the pieces on the board. Now, we're going to make sure that we don't observe the board, or observe the pieces that we want to move, because like Young's split experiment, when they wasn't observing, the experiment it would do something differently so maybe just like us not observing the pieces on the board moving because they're being covered so I'll show you what we're gonna do let's set this game up what we're gonna do is I'm just gonna place these look at these these are normal look at them yeah there's no magnets on them there's no trickery here in fact I'm gonna move in fact we're gonna should we move everything off the table yeah sure it's, it's just a standard board, look, look at a standard table. Got this table from Amazon. Okay, so as you can see, these are all standard pieces that come with the game. We're going to place them on the board. I'm going to put them, ideally, we want to put them there, but we've got to put a cover over the top of the board, so we're going to place them on the first step. So.
That's the cardboard box below me. Anyway, hearing some weird noises again, so it yeah. spooks us out every single time. Okay, so now these pieces, as we can see, they're all on their spaces, correct? Okay, yep. now. You want me to put it the other way? Yeah, so let's go to this way. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'm going to place this lid over the top of these pieces. So can you see the pieces, though? They're not moved, they're all on the first space, yeah? Yeah. Okay. And just to make sure, we'll move them. Move it again. Are they also in the same place? Yep. Yeah. Can we just do that a few more times? Make sure that I'm not knocking them or nothing. Well. Okay. No, there's no cuts, no nothing here, guys. Ready? Mm. They still there? Mhm. Mm I'll work that one. Same place. Do that again. Ready? Mm -hmm. Once more now. So. Just to clarify. They're all in the same all place. All in the same space. Okay. Here we go. Spirits, we call upon you, come forward, communicate with us, show us that you're here by moving those pieces on the board game. So now we've got a dice and what we're going to do is we're going to roll the dice and we're going to ask the spirits to move the piece on the board the same amount of numbers as on the dice. So let's see if it works. I've never done this before. Okay, you ready? Number five. Can you please move one of the pieces on the Jumanji board the same amount of numbers as on the dice, please? We'll give you some time to do it. So what we're doing is we're not observing it happening. So if we don't observe it, will it happen? Just like Young's split experiment. You know what I'm saying, Pablo? Yeah. So hopefully... The spirits are actually going to move these things for us now. To be honest, I'm not entirely sure it's going to work, but it's worth a try, isn't it? Because mm -hmm. you never know when something like this might happen one day. And uh, it would be groundbreaking for it to happen as well. My oh, spider's gone. The spider's gone? Yeah. Oh, that's even worse. Me and Paolo are going to go for a little walk around this place. And we're going to let the spirits move the pieces on the board. And hopefully they'll do it, but we're not going to be in here, so let's go. go that way. Hopefully we get to catch whatever the hell's moving outside. Mm -hmm. Oh, should I put night shot on? Mm -hmm. Night shot. Ah, oh, it's freezing. Yeah, put... I've got night shot on. you yeah. got it on now, have you? Yeah. We're going to need the... Uh, Infrared know, camera. Yeah. Go get it. Wait, can you see my breath? We'll get it in a minute. Okay. We don't need it right now. We've got lights anyway. Yeah. You can still see, can't you? Have a yeah. Look. Yeah. Just a little bit blind when I look in front of you. We'll get it now because we're going this side. <laughs> oh, that hand warmer's never. Oh, somewhere. that was bumpy. Yeah, that's way better. Okay, so we're gonna go for a little walk around here. So this is, let's go on top of the cafe. Oh no, but I feel like we're doing so bad. <sighs> that, I need help. But if... Watch them break everything. <sighs> oh. Okay, so now I'm on top of the capstone. It's crazy up here, it's a bit of a mad feeling. I feel like I'm gonna get pushed. I'm gonna ask the spirits again now. Spirits, we've come here to Tinkinswood Burial Chamber. We've left a board game inside the chamber. We would like you to move a piece on the board game the same amount of spaces that's on the dice. It was five spaces. Can you please move a piece on the board five spaces? If that thing moves. <laughs> that just 
I'm scared if that moves. If that moves, I am out of here. I'll be out of here full stop anyway, like for Rambo. So the camera just turned itself off and that's the second time now. That's happened, something like that's happened. That's the second time something's happened with the cameras. Now we're actually heading back, we're gonna go and check to see if any of these pieces have moved. We've got to walk back in the same way we came, Paolo. Okay. This way. This is now the big reveal, guys. We've come back inside. We haven't touched this Jumanji bird whatsoever. Yeah, let's let's the big Let's reveal. Go for it then. The big reveal. Here we go. Nope. Nothing. Hasn't moved at all. We will try it again somewhere else. I'll continue trying to do this method. I think maybe if we go somewhere where there's children's spirits, I think maybe they'd be more interested in playing these games. That's it for tonight guys, we're going to pack up, the experiment didn't work tonight but we're going to try it again somewhere else, we're going to keep doing it until it works. Spiritual Awakening, signing out. <laughs>